Yeah, so, so we have the square root of a plus b squared, all right? Now, when looking at a problem like this, John, we need to kind of remember, all right, how is this going to work here? Well, if remember, if I have the square root of x squared, we know that that answer was just equal to x, right? Then if I said, what about if I had the square root of 4x squared? Well, we could break that down into, um, we could break that down into 2x. So it's just a b. Right? So yes, what's happening is you're undoing, or I'm sorry, let's rewrite this into 2 squared times x squared, which can be rewritten as 2x squared, right? I'm just rewriting my format. But what's in the main important thing you guys need to know about, if I have something squared and I'm taking the square root, those are inverse operations, right? It's like adding and subtracting. If you take the square root of something squared, that's undoing it, right? If you multiply then divide, you're undoing inverse operations. So I'm squaring something, and then I'm taking the square root of it. So your final answer is just a, a plus b. Oh, that was easy. OK. Good job. I like them. All right, so I'll give you guys one last.